Hello friends, it's Raymond from my permaculture property. Uh, as usually trying to answer the question, why to live, why should we live bad way if you can live the good way? Yeah, and uh, as usually I want to thank for everyone who supports us uh, physically, spiritually and financially. And uh, just want to remind you that if you want to support us financially, you can do this on Patreon and find the link above. And today I want to introduce you uh, the hot grafting system, one of the hot grafting systems uh, which uh, we use when we need to uh, graft plants uh, which need uh, the uh, heat for, for, for graft union to form. And uh, it is basically uh, the case when you live in uh, more temperate, cold temperate climate, cool climates where where it is not possible to do this outside. For example, in, for example, I live in zone four five, uh, four to five, and uh, it is not possible to do this outside. For example, to graft uh, mulberry, it's very difficult to do this. Uh, it's almost impossible to do this with walnuts. Uh, you cannot do this at all, and uh, that's why we use uh, hot systems. And uh, the three things we should. Uh, take into consideration when grafting uh, plants in hot systems are temperature, humidity and the root pressure. So uh, the, if you got the like grafting room or, or, or polytunnel or something else, uh, we provide it with heat, uh, we need humidifier to make the temperature well and we need to assure that uh, if we got the plants uh, who got the very strong root pressure like walnuts uh, not to seal uh, the graft union and to leave it you know opened uh, but then you have to provide with the right humidity uh, to, you know to, to, to because it will dry very fast uh, so the temperature as well need to be very strict with temperature uh, but uh, today i want to introduce you with the hot pipe system so uh, the, let me show you hot pipe system, my hot pipe system, and it looks like this, my hot pipe system, and basically what we've got here, uh, I've got a table, you know, insulated table. Uh, I've got such chamber, it make with two uh, wooden, uh, I don't know how to call it in English. Okay, you see <laughs> two wooden things, and the heating cables, ca cable, is in there, heating cable. Just simple like this, you know, heating cable and the temperature controller. The temperature controller is the cheapest uh, for, from, you know, Chinese temperature controls. But uh, what I have to tell you that it, it serves many for many years and in very rush condition with me, as you see. And it keep working and working and over, working. I've got maybe 10 of them and uh, none has uh, broken. So, yeah, it's really good. So here I've got the sensor of this controller and uh, what I want to tell you the sensor is, is fixed rigidly over here because it is really important you see it's fixed over here um, because it if it is if it fall down uh, or, or move somewhere else then it will for example here yeah you will you will move your plants or something do something else it will move here and uh, the temperature it won't gain the temperature and the heating cable will start heating 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 and destroy all the graphs like and the main thing is that uh, we seal this graft, we make the graft, we seal it. Uh, so that's why we don't care about the humidity. We don't have to provide the right humidity over here. The other thing, uh, we heat only the graft place. You see, only the graft place is over here. Uh, we cover it. I cover it with such material. You know, you use your imagination, cover whatever you want, make the construction, whatever you is suitable for you, whatever materials you've got. And I press, uh, put some wooden uh, things over here, press it, you know, and uh, use the pit. At this case, sometimes, sometimes sawdust. Uh, also, whatever material is available for you, use it. Uh, so just don't let the uh, these roots to dry. And we hold these roots hold, cold. Like for example, if you got walnut, we don't want to get more than five degrees Celsius Celsius here uh, because the root pressure uh, st will start become a problem uh, sap will 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 flow uh, up uh, the, 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 up to the uh, grafting place 
and the uh, union won't form so we, 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 we hold it cold and for some for some plants it is not so uh, important but for for example here we've got the mulberry uh, it don't like it too, as well and the other benefit we've got here we don't have to substantially uh, dry it out uh, the roots dry out because we are not afraid of root pressure so it's also the benefit of it and the other benefit is that we use so little energy to heat only this place so imagine if you have all these plants and we have to provide the humidity the temperature for whole place that they are growing or that they are forming these unions so how many energy we should use for that you know if it's, and here we heat only this place and take a look how many plants are here you can use it for one you know one meter i don't know 40 maybe 30 uh, plants so i'd say it's quite good and uh, the one thing uh, i want to tell you that i have destroyed uh, 40 of very rare walnuts i've got i've gotten from my ukrainian friend uh, he sent me uh, this year but the mistake i made i put it roots you know the graft union was over here and uh, the roots was like like in this place but the problem is uh, that the heat when it goes through this place yeah it, it dries out the roots and the plant dies so be careful try to make the graft union at least 10 or 20 centimeters above the the roots so it should look like this you see here we got sealant everywhere yeah and here we got the graft, grafting place so one more benefit of using hot pipe system is that you don't make this plant awake so if you need to uh, move the time you know to save the time a little bit of time and uh, you don't want to plant to wake up so you hit only this place and if you use the cyan uh, long enough uh, then when the graft union uh, has formed uh, you will put it to the basement or whatever place uh, you want to hold them uh, cold uh, and uh, it will it will won't uh, start growing because you know you've got only this place and if you this bud uh, which is over here uh, start grow I, I just rip it off and that's it and leave this plant if I need to delay you know the planting time so it is one more benefit of using this so I like it uh, I like the system uh, very much by, by now and hope you like it too I hope I was useful for you and uh, see you next time. Bye.